Hi everyone, welcome to Winter Fun. Today we will be making several different crafts with wintry, snowy, and chilly themes. All of the materials that we'll be using are items that you might have at home already, and the grab and go kit for this program will provide you materials that you can use as well. The crafts are simple and lots of fun for the whole family to make together. Our first craft will be construction paper snowflakes. For this craft, you'll need two pieces of construction paper, scissors, tape, and a stapler. Put the two pieces of construction paper flat on the table next to each other. Tape the ends of the pieces of paper together. Now fold the paper in an accordion or paper fan shape Once you have folded the entire length of the paper, staple the center of the paper once. Using a scissor, cut both ends into an arrow shape, trimming off the corners. Now you can cut small triangles all along the edges of the paper. This will make your snowflake pattern. Unfold the paper and secure the loose ends with a piece of tape. Now you have a large snowflake. Today's second craft is a cupcake liner snowflake. The supplies for this craft are a cupcake liner and scissors. Gently flatten the cupcake liner into a circle. Fold it in half once. Fold it in half to create a triangular shape. Fold as many times as you can until you have a small triangular shape. Use your scissor to cut small triangles or other designs along the edges of the cupcake liner. Carefully unfold and you will have a neat snowflake. The third craft today is a coffee filter snowflake. You'll need a round paper coffee filter and scissors. If you have any decorative edge scissors or a hole punch, those can be used for this craft as well. Gently flatten the round coffee filter into a circle. Now fold the coffee filter in half. Keep folding the coffee filter in half until you have a small triangular shape. Use your scissor, decorative scissor, and hole punch, and you can cut out designs along the paper.
unfolds carefully and you'll have an amazing snowflake. Today's fourth craft is a paper doily snowflake. You'll need some paper doilies in various sizes, scissors, crayons and or markers, and if you have them, some washable watercolor paints work well too. Pick some wintry, cool, icy colors to fill in the center of the paper doily. Try blending some colors like purple and blue. Fold the paper doily in half and keep folding it into a small triangular shape. Cut some designs in the edge of the doily with your scissor. Carefully unfold the doily and look at the amazing snowflake. The fifth craft is paper icicles. For this craft, you'll need some cardstock or paper, a small piece of ribbon, glue, scissors, tape, and if you have some glitter or glitter glue. On a piece of cardstock or paper, draw some tall triangles with a base of about one to two inches wide. Cut out two of these long triangles. Use some glue to attach the two wide bases of the triangle together. Fold long ends of the triangle over each other as many times as you can until your two pieces of cardstock have created a small paper tower. When you don't have any more paper to fold, gently pull the narrowest end of the paper and you will have an icicle shape. Attach a small piece of ribbon to the wide top end of the icicle with glue. This is what you can use to hang it up as a decoration. If you want to take some glue and line the edges of the icicle and add some glitter, you can give it an extra sparkle. Glitter glue works very well too. Our sixth and final craft today is a winter paper collage. For this craft, you will need a piece of cardstock or paper, some old magazines or leftover pieces of construction paper in assorted colors, scissors, glue, a pencil, and some snowflake decorations like stickers or foam shapes. On your piece of cardstock or paper, Draw a winter scene, for example, a giant snowflake, or a snowman, or a snowy forest. Then using pieces of old magazines or leftover construction paper, glue them onto your paper to fill in the objects in your winter scene. When you are done filling in the scene, you can use crayons or markers to complete the rest of your picture. 
you can use pipe cleaners, pom-poms, stickers, or any other craft supplies to add more detail to your winter scene too. If you draw a snowman, you can make a scarf or earmuffs for it, or you can add some snowflakes to the winter sky. Decorate as much as you'd like. I hope you have fun making these crafts today. Add some extra sparkle to any of these crafts with a little glitter or shiny ribbon. As we get ready for the winter season to begin, you can take a snowflake break and enjoy making some of these crafts to decorate your home or to give as gifts to someone special. Have a wonderful winter. Thanks for joining this program and see you next time. Bye.